Hi, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. Today I want to talk about mirror work, the law of attraction. People usually say the eyes are the seat of the soul. And that is literally true. What is it that you see in your eyes? Does it tell a story of pain, sorrow, happiness, joy, love, betrayal? What is it that your eyes tell? This is the story. This is what we call mirror work. For many years, people have been fascinated with the mirror. What is it that you see reflected back? Do you see love, happiness? Well, today we're going to talk about how we can use the mirror to release all that there is that needs to be released. Many people look in the mirror and they see themselves, but they miss the entire point of what is it inside of them that is being reflected back on them. These reflections are the things that are stopping you from getting what you want. Either it's helping you get what you want or it's stopping you. The eyes tell it all. There's no lying when it comes down to the eyes. Today we're going to talk about looking in the mirror, uncovering what it is that you see in your eyes and releasing it so that you can bring out all the abundance that you need to manifest the things in your life that you desire. When I first looked in my eyes, I cried. Like many of you out there, you looked into those eyes and you seen the deep sorrow, pain of whatever happened in your lifetime. Those childhood traumas, being bullied, missing your parents when you went off to school. All the things that you see are in your eyes. Everything that you see is recorded and revealed to you through your eyes. Today we're going to talk about a way of releasing this pain and sorrow in your eyes by using simple techniques that, that unleashes miraculous results and it's called mirror work it's part of the law of attraction many people out there are trying to manifest all the things in their life that they can but they come and they say it's not working it's not true it just doesn't work for me most likely you have some kind of block in your life that is stopping you from getting what you want Many times, this can be revealed to you through your eyes. Go in the bathroom. Take out a mirror. Take out a makeup mirror. Look in your reflection in the glass. What is it that you see? What's in your eyes? What is it that you see? Let's start off by looking in your eyes. And just say, I love you. Say, I love you. And if you find that difficult to do in the beginning, just say, I am beginning to love you more and more and more each day. Yes. You may think it sounds stupid at first, but try it and tell me how you feel. I am beginning to love you more and more each day. And then... When you feel comfortable doing that, you can say, I love you. I love you. Talk to yourself in the mirror. Talk to that person in the mirror. What do you want to tell that person? When I first started doing mirror work, I found it silly to go in the mirror and just say, I love you. I was one of those people that needed to start by saying, 
I am growing to love you more and more and more each day. After a while, maybe a couple of days, I was able to say and really feel it. I love you. But with these two first steps of mirror work, it came a lot of pain. Out came a lot of pain. I cried for the first three and four days. And then after that, I no longer had the problem. I went ahead and I continued my mirror work. I am growing to love you more and more each day, looking deep into my eyes, crying sometimes. The next step I did was, I love you. Then, then I went on to, I forgive you. I forgive you for all the things you have done in your lifetime. Things that I was proud of, things that I wasn't. I forgive you with everything I have done in my lifetime because I know I did the best that I could at that moment. Whether it was due to inexperience or just being a knucklehead. I forgive you. I forgive you for everything you've done. I forgive you for all your past relationships. I forgive you for all the things that you've done that you know you've done. You judge your own self. You're the judge and the jury in your life. I forgive you. I forgive you and I release whatever it is that I need to release. I look deep into my eyes and then as that got easier, I said, I am deserving of everything that there is. I am totally deserving of all that there is. God loves me. God is inside of me. I am inside of myself. God, myself, and my higher self are all one. I am entitled and deserving of everything that there is. And I opened up my arms and I said, I am receptive to all that there is. I am deserving of everything God has for me because God and I are one. And whatever it is that I desire, it is my divine right to have. I looked deep into my eyes and I said, I love you. I love you. And then I said, I got this. I got this. I totally have this. I have this on the outside and you have this on the inside. And God is the creator. As I stood there looking in the mirror in my own eyes, I released whatever barrier whatever I had in me that was blocking me from manifesting all that I needed in my life as I did that things opened up I received twenty two thousand dollars within three weeks I manifest the best 50th birthday party when I said manifest the best 50th birthday party it was unbelievable my wish was for people to talk about my 50th birthday for years to come. And I accomplished that. The next thing I did was manifest a great increase in my subscribers, getting myself out there. All of this happened within about a month, month and a half of me redoing mirror work. So I advise you and so many of you to get out there and start doing your mirror work. Start doing your therapy on yourself. Start allowing God to bless you with the abundance that you're deserving of. Get out there and look in that mirror and open your arms and say, I am deserving of everything God has for me. I am deserving of love. I am deserving of a better job. I am deserving of everything that God has for me and it is my divine right. I walk with boldness and I got this for I love you. I love myself and because I love myself, I am deserving of everything that there is. Mirror work will release whatever it is that's holding you back. It allows you to manifest whatever it is that you need to manifest. 
talk to yourself, look in your eyes and say, what is it that I believe about me that is stopping me from getting what I want? Is it true? Well, if I believe it's true, I can also change it. Look into your eyes, talk to yourself and release all that there is that you need to release. Mirror work is miraculous. It's unbelievable. And it will bring you the results that you desire. This is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics, bringing you another law of attraction, metaphysical lesson from the girl next door. If you like this video, please like it. Please subscribe. It keeps me going. Thank you. You can follow me at myworldofmetaphysics.com. You can buy crystals and jewelry at store.myworldofmetaphysics.com. You can find me on YouTube, Instagram, Pinterest at myworldofmetaphysics.com. This is Yvette. This video was on mirror work, the law of attraction, and namaste.